mongooses. Like the mango, the mongoose came to Jamaica from India. It was brought here to kill cane piece rats over a hundred years ago. At that time, rats were giving a great deal of trouble on the sugar plantations. Many thousands of dollars of cane were lost every year because of rats. And here we have a picture with the cane being cut and we can see rats in the cane piece. In 1872, someone said that the planters should try and bring some mongooses into the island as these animals were good rat killers. This was agreed and some mongooses were brought in from England where they were being kept. But these were not the wild kind and instead of killing rats, the mongooses ran away from them. After that, a planter named Mr. W. B. Espute sent to India for some wild ones. He got nine of them and put them on his spring gardens plantation in Portland. When these first mongoose had young ones, he sold them for one dollar each. People call the mongooses Sonny Espute. All the mongooses that exist in Jamaica came from these first ones. And the picture that we have here shows a mongoose in the process of eating a rat. These mongooses were very good at killing the cane piece rats and all went well for the first few years. The mongooses saved the estates from losing money. People said that the mongoose was a wonderful animal. After a while, however, things began to go wrong. The rats took to the trees and the mongooses learned to eat other things. They started eating fruits, birds, lizards and other wild animals. But worst of all, they started eating hens, chickens and eggs. They killed many of the Jamaican yellow snakes which did not trouble people and were used to eating many of the rats. Soon they were giving as much trouble as the cane piece rats. The same people who had been so glad when the mongoose first came now started looking for ways to kill them off. Nowadays, there are not as many mongooses as there were a hundred years ago, but they are still a problem to people who have farms with chicken and eggs. Whenever the mongooses are seen, dogs and people would run after them and try to kill them. The homeland of the mongoose is India. In that country, they are very useful in killing dangerous snakes. They eat the eggs and the young snakes and kill the grown-up ones. People have mongooses as pets in their homes so that they will keep out snakes. They make very good pets as they learn to live with people easily and are very clean animals. In Jamaica, very few people would ever think of a mongoose as a pet. But there was a story in the newspaper in 1961 about a headman who found two baby mongooses on his land. They were only a few days old and the mother had been killed. The headman took one of the mongooses and put it with a mother cat and her young ones. The mother cat killed it. He took the other one and rubbed it all over with one of the baby cats so that it would have the cat smell. Then he gave it to the mother cat. She loved it and looked after it as if it were her own. There is a belief about mongooses and luck on the road. Sometimes when we are going along a road or path, we see a mongoose run across the road in front of us. Sometimes they run right across, but at other times they run halfway and turn back. People say that it's a sign of bad luck if they stop and turn back. There is a funny story about the word mongoose. Some people are not sure what to say if they are talking about more than one mongoose. They are not sure if they should say mongooses or mongoose or leave it as mongoose. The story is that in 1872, someone was writing a letter to a trader asking for 12 mongooses to be sent to Jamaica. He was not sure what word to use, so he wrote, Please send me one mongoose and 11 others. <laughs>